I believe the very last time we wore a choker necklace was during the late 90s Spice Girls era where every girl had to have that black tattoo choker necklace around her neck. It was a huge trend back then and I remember us nagging our parents to get one no matter what. In today's tutorial, we'll show you simple steps in making your very own Tazy choker and hope you enjoy. Have fun! As always, here are a few outfits we put together and I'm wearing a soft aqua color netted sweater that feels wonderful on the skin. We're both very picky when it comes to choosing a sweater due to our extremely sensitive skin. Often they're itchy or harsh to the skin which makes it very uncomfortable to wear. But luckily this one felt as soft as our blankets. For the bottom, I went with white skirts and finish off with again my favorite Jeffrey Campbell. <laughs> For the second outfit, I simply toned down the color of the sweater and went out loud with this gorgeous daisy print skirt. The combination of white, orange, and turquoise greens colors are unbearably luscious and the elastic waistband gave an additional plus to comfort. One tip for choosing a pair of shoes when bare-legged is to choose a one with color that matches to your skin tone. It will definitely help to achieve an elongated look. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the tutorial and have fun! If you prefer, also try using black nail polish and paint around the circumference of the daisies. It adds more animated feel to the choker, which makes it more unique apart from others. By the way, we're truly sorry about infrequent garment tutorials lately. School has been really crazy for the past couple of weeks. Nevertheless, we're currently working on two-piece bralette top and skirt, so please stay tuned and we thank you so much for your patience and support. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you soon. Have fun!